what's up what's up welcome back to my channel long time no see it's been a while since i vlogged i feel like i did cut my hair if you guys saw my instagram i cut it right now it's like really straight but when my hair is curly like shrinks up so well my hair is not that curly but when it's a little wavy and stuff like that it shrinks up so right now it's like a little bit past my boob but when it's curly it's like right here and if you guys knew my hair was to my ass like all the way to my hip so i just wanted to like kind of update you guys put some clips in here to tell you guys what's going on catch up on all the material all the content that i have out right now recorded so what you're gonna see in this video is probably a replay from back in the day we're gonna go back in time and look at the times where i got my inventory in so i was so 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 excited when i got my inventory i will show you guys i did also go through some trouble i had them mess up a whole order and then they also messed up again and sent me a whole different color that i didn't need it but it all worked out because those ended up being a top seller anyway so i thrifted this chanel two-piece set i doubt it's real chanel but it's the chanel embroidered two-piece set it has the chanel pants and i love it i love the fit of it i love how it's like very loose but jog wear but cute so i'm definitely gonna keep this for myself i'm a little sweaty right now too because i was dancing tiktok dances so if you don't follow me follow me on tiktok i'm trying to be like on and popping on there now and it's really really fun fun fact i used to always want to know how to do choreographies and dances and stuff like that so i feel like i can live through that through tiktok dances so late to the game but it's okay follow me O underscore it's Lissa's all the same. All my social media is the same except for my brand, Lissa's Line, Lissa's Line.com. Go check it out. I am going to go ahead and show you guys the videos right now. Oh my God, y'all. I'm so excited. <laughs> Look, I made my first product. <laughs> I'm so happy. I saw the FedEx truck outside and I was like, oh, no way. <laughs> I wanna cry, oh my god. I know this is something so small, but I just wanna cry. I got my first tote bag. I hope y'all like it. A baby pink, my favorite color. And it says, it's thrifted bitch on it. And it has my um, line on here. I got a whole box of them. Can't wait until the black ones come in. I think they might come in tomorrow or the next day. It is 20 inches wide. And then I think 16 inches high. Guess what just got here? Oh, bitch, look at this. Oh. Look at that. Yes, uh, look at the detail. <gasps> These are so fucked up. The pink ones came perfect. They came so smooth, perfect. I'm gonna go through that whole box now that I've been through this one, but look at how splotchy that is look how splotchy that is like how come it's not as smooth as this you go to the its it's so splotchy again splotchy splotchy right here look at that who how is that acceptable look how good this came out so smooth so good then you go to these it's so fucked up have been 
putting them in these little baggies like really nice and folded i love how they turned out and on the back it says Lissa's line i was so mad when they sent like really bad order i went through all of the black ones and i literally only got like a few of the black and actual pink ones that i wanted um literally like six like <laughs> six good ones that are good and i got a lot of pink ones are very very good i'm really happy about those pink ones but they i complained to them and they sent me a whole nother batch but obviously that's not the same pink i was so mad i went through these they sent me 60 because i told them i only found like 60 in here that i were messed up and i was being way too nice they were actually all messed up like i ordered 75 and of each color I'm not going to accept or give y'all anything other than perfection, honestly. So I've been going through these bags and folding them. I mean, in a way, it's cool. I have three different colors. And this is not a bad color. I like this color. It's just that that other color, I just love it way I just better. Got the mail. I'm so, 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 so it's excited. I got my Vistaprint cards. These are my thank you cards for my business. So excited, one step closer now. What's left is me to just finish the website and finish editing these promo pictures and product pictures. I just gotta edit them. I already took most of the pictures. I just wanna take maybe one more set of pictures and then I'll be done. But oh, I need to calm down. I need to calm down. I'm gonna show you guys, hold on. Do you guys see the peak? Oh my god, I already love them. Oh my god. What? Bitch, look. That is fire. This is line. Oh my god, look at the back. What I want to do is get a white Sharpie so I can write people's names in white. Um, but yeah, I love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Ready for my business. Lissasline.com. So excited. I want to start the launch on December 1st because December is my birthday month. I'm so happy. I'm so excited. I can't wait to take you guys on this journey. And I'm just so, 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 so excited. But yeah. I'll let you guys know any more updates, but yeah. <laughs> that was everything from those clips. So now on to the rest of the vlog. Another update is I got a sewing machine, bitch. And sorry if you hear dogs. There's a dog park right outside of my apartment. Oh, sorry about the mess. I did my makeup today here and I also have this stuff open from the sewing machine. But anyway, this is my sewing machine. I love it. I haven't used it yet. I've never used a sewing machine before, ever. So I am going to be looking at this later tonight. I want to read through all these. I don't have a CD player, so I don't know how that's going to work, but I'm probably just going to look it up on YouTube. Also, I got some new shoes. I got it as a birthday gift. Let me show you guys the new kicks. These are the Air Force One Pixels. I love these. And they are a little bit different than what everybody else has. I wanted some all white Air Forces, but I just, I saw these and I was like, this is me. I like to have something a little bit different than what everybody else has. So this was so cute. I wanted to hang this up. I got this at the thrift store, but I don't know where I want to hang it. Either I want to hang it right here. What do you guys think? Right here, right here, next to my desk, like right here. Or I put it on this side, on this wall. So let me know. Just wanted to let you guys know I have the Is Thrifted, Is Thrifted Bitch stickers. I love these. I put them everywhere now. I love how the Is Thrifted Bitch logo is shiny. And the rest is kind of matte or whatever. Hopefully you guys can see that. I want to show you guys my outfit. So here is my outfit i love this to be said i can't believe i found this i found this for like ten dollars too so such a good deal i love it and if you don't know you can like tuck your sweatshirt into your bra and like makes it into a crop top but if you don't want it at a crop top just untuck it and we're good to go i wanted to show you guys some of these pieces that i found at the thrift store i love 
love love love love love these pieces i got this really silky satin long maxi dress with a slit in it and then this carolina blues denim dress with the halter top neck oh my god and then these beautiful pinstripe dress it also has a thigh slit i want to try this on see if it fits me sorry about all the dust i just took these out the bag and then also this corduroy jacket this would definitely be on my depop with a faux fur i love this jacket and this is definitely mine this is like a businesswoman business casual kind of thing and then this cute little mini skirt reminds me of like barbie vibes i love the baby pink in it and then i'm gonna keep this skirt for myself it's like a cargo denim skirt with this little belt I remember these belts all the time were super super popular in the 2000s i love this mini skirt so cute and then i got this really cute matching cardigan with this little crop top it has this crochet details with the ribbon on it and a little bow in the front and it also has the matching cardigan so this is a size large it would definitely be on my depop so go ahead and check it out and then i got this really cute bodysuit it's just a black plain bodysuit that i needed and then this really cool vintage top i love these micro mesh tops they're so so cute this one is not as see-through as all the other ones i pick up but definitely a staple and then i got this really cute one-piece jumpsuit or romper it is a shorts denim shorts tube top fit i love this thing is definitely mini it definitely shows my ass so I'll definitely be on my depop for sure once i get a couple pictures in it and then i found this really cute baby pink nike top this really cool vest this like military style vest that you can definitely layer over so many things and this really cute two-piece set is a blazer set it's so flattering and this victoria's secrets mini 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 dress it definitely has your ass out so i want to keep these i want to sleep every day in some really nice sexy stuff that's very comfortable because i just want to feel my best all the time i'm tired of wearing ugly t-shirts and pjs so that's a little tip for you guys i may also keep this one too this is a medium though this is a really beautiful silky kind of dress as well for a slip dress hold on i want to show you guys these glasses that this company sent me love 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 what they stand for love the glasses and everything like that okay dog just a quick shout out to this company t-i-j-n life is art so this is a glasses company and they sent me some glasses i've really really been trying out these glasses since about my birthday and i love them so much this is the box that it gets goes to and then they also give you a case so i got two glasses i got a sunglass and i also got some regular glasses this is a regular magnet class case right here and then this one has a snap on right here and it's so soft it's like a suede leather like feeling and it's so cute i love this color they also throwed in some cleaning cloths for your glasses of course the microfiber cloths i'm actually gonna open one right now because i've been wearing my glasses these are prescription glasses they also have anti glare on them and i love them i was afraid that they're gonna be really heavy because of my prescription but they're not thick at all whatsoever and i have a pretty heavy prescription especially for my astigmatism but i love these they're such a good quality i love the metal the gold frame it's such a retro fit and that's what i loved about it so let me try them on for you guys i don't know if you guys like the vibe but i love this vibe it's such a like um retro school girl or i don't know it's just kind of cute little vintage vibe i love them something different they're definitely really really big let me take them off because i have my contacts in the cutest part about these glasses i didn't even know it came with these when i chose these glasses is this little jewel right here how pretty is that so it looks like a little like a little jewel like an earring it looks like a little earring just hanging in your hair and if you have your hair up or something oh my god that would be so cute i chose these really big square retro sunglasses i honestly thought they're going to be a lot darker but i'm actually glad that they're not so these are these sunglasses i love these sunglasses i'm always wearing them in pictures now and on my tiktok videos so i love them so much these are definitely really lightweight and these are definitely i feel like a little bit more cheaper quality i'm not gonna lie than the other glasses but overall for the price that you pay for this website is so affordable who spends hella money on glasses anymore i used to work optical and people would have spent thousands of dollars hundreds of dollars on glasses thank god for these online companies now because 
you can get way more glasses have so much fun with glasses now like look my fit just went from zero to 100 just wearing these glasses like look at that thank you tijn for sending me these glasses i really 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 love them and i appreciate them i'll put their website in the description of course if you guys want to check it out and yeah of course this video is not sponsored by them or anything like that they just sent me these glasses and i love them love them so much as far as like growth and social media growth i am going to try this myself it's gonna be a lot harder because i have i'm juggling so many things and now that i'm back in school i have class every single morning i'm going to be trying to grow my social media presence and stuff like that i want to talk to you guys about what i'm gonna do so if you guys want to do the same thing and if it starts to work for me or something like that well the lighting is just changing right now I'm sorry about that. Like I said, I was never on TikTok before, so now I made a TikTok. I'm trying to get videos out now. I send a bunch of the ideas and explore page ideas and things that are trending or I think is about to be trending. Or if someone's idea pops up another idea in my head, I send the video to my inbox and write my own idea so I can kind of redo it but my own way. So I send it all to myself on TikTok inbox. So that's one thing that I've been doing. You want to repost basically all your TikTok videos onto Reels because Instagram made those other segments a part of the platform for a reason. So if you use them, you're going to get pushed out more. Plus, people react better and interact better with video anyway. So I have been making Reels for both my brand's page and also my personal page because I kind of want them separate but at the same time together. But... With that being said is I've been kind of being more personality based. I'm trying to put my personality out there more on my social media like Instagram and TikTok and stuff like that. I don't really use Twitter as much anymore because it's just, I just feel like it's just like a newspaper in a way. <laughs> or I don't know. I just don't have time for Twitter. And I heard there's a lot of drama on Twitter all the time. So I, I, I just don't have time. I post here and there, but barely. I would say for me, my biggest things is TikTok instagram and youtube i'm trying to post consistently every single day at least a reel or a video or a picture or like a quote or something on my brand's page i want to post something every day and i also post when i see more engagement so like around 5 6 7 p.m usually after work hours is when i post i never post during the day or really in the morning unless i'm on my stories so i just wanted to share that tip and hopefully you guys can do the same thing maybe grow your business or whatever so that's one thing i've been doing also hit 10k on depop Woo! got 10k followers on depop thank you so much i love you guys so 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 much you know some video ideas you guys want to see if you guys like the chit chat videos if you guys like the vlog type videos if you guys like anything <laughs> um just let me know and i'm always down to like make anything you guys want i don't really have any more updates i'm gonna go ahead and end this video right here thank you so much for watching i love you guys so so much please subscribe I upload two times a week thank you so 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 much for watching and i'll talk to you guys in the next one bye